Hey guys, Ruby Ryan JKU. Uh, I haven't done a video in a week or two. I've been busy with uh, doing some random stuff. Um, I'm actually, I, I own a company called Crawler Off-Road Ropes. And I'm actually selling that company. Uh, some couple new guys or buddies are getting together and, and they're going to keep it going under the same name. Um, so that will be gone. Um, I have a, a website called Tracks Overland that I've been working on for a while. And somebody somebody else out there has overlandtracks.com or something so i just said you know what for what i'm doing i'm gonna redo the whole thing start from scratch so i have started i actually applied got the uh, llc um of a company called odin and what odin is is it is a overland and off-road company um i'm going to make some different products i'm going to make fenders is number one on my list uh tube fenders for the m uh, M416 trailer, uh, but it's an, a universal fit, so it would fit on pretty much any home brew, you know, off or overland off road trailer you want. Uh, it should work. Uh, I'll hopefully have some more info on that real soon because I've got the prototypes pretty much done. I'm just waiting on a few parts to get here uh, so I can finish those up. <clears throat> um i'm also going to maybe in the future do full trailers i'm i'm not sure yet if i want to start building complete trailers um i'm working on a bunch of different leads on that trying to get something something going where i can have a uh, ready built trailer you pretty much choose the options you want and it'll be you know put onto a chassis and heading out to you uh you know that's kind of the 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 short version of it but it's something i'm working on so um the the website is actually odinoffroad.com or um odinoverland.com or odintrailers.com i bought all of them um all underneath the brand i have a different logo for each one of them just to kind of keep them a little bit separate but uh something i've been kind of wanting to do for a while it gives me a, a big broad range of stuff i'm hoping to, to eventually carry some different jeep parts that i want to make um some overland stuff i want to make smaller stuff brackets um builder parts people that don't have a tubing bender but want um fender they want to build their own fenders so i could bend the tubing for them they can do the rest um just some things like that um it's just kind of a, a side fun hobby business i'm looking into to growing so um check that out and then uh the trailer i've been working on is getting real close to um to comp to getting ready to paint the fenders are pretty much the last thing i'm waiting on um i gotta prep the body and stuff and get that ready for for bed line which i'm doing that and then i can start putting it all together uh, putting the electric and everything into it and i'll do a video on that uh, other than that um i've got uh, a million different things going on that i want to do a little video sh you know little little shots i just i haven't had time uh, i've been going pretty much non-stop so um, keep your eye out for a video. I'm going to do a few little, um, even if it's just a review bit video on some of the stuff I've done, give you some ideas in that. Um, I, I pimped my shop press. I've been working with that, trying to make that a little bit cooler. And, um, I, uh, I built a rogue, uh, rogue fab tubing bender. I put that together, welded it up. It's working great. Um, I customized that a little bit, so I was going to show, show that part to it. And then, um, I wrapped my Jeep, um, not this weekend but the weekend before um did a vinyl wrap on it it's only the th third I think the third vinyl wrap i've ever done in my life so uh, i'm pretty pretty proud how it came out and turned out real real well so um i'll put up a picture of that for you too and then um i'd like to even do a video on wrapping but i need to um i need to i need another vehicle to do it on so um hopefully all some of this will be coming up soon um and then uh, one other little thing of news. Um, I'm sure if you watch any of my videos, um, I've been chewing since I was like 16. And I finally decided to quit. So today today is day four, I think, um, with no nicotine. I just pretty much just up and quit it. Um, so I'm hanging in there. It's really not that bad, to be honest, going through. I feel a little floaty and foggy headed. But other than that, I'm doing pretty good. So um stick back once i get a little farther along with this i'll do kind of a, a little video on that on progress and, and what i've done to actually help me quit and, and why and everything else so anyway thanks for watching guys um keep your out for more videos